Right, yes. now we can yep, go can live. <laughs> can you see? There you are. Yes. Going live. Just two seconds here. We're wheelsy. Oh, oh, we're live. We're live. Whoa, hi guys. Uh, I kind of feel honored today. I, Diane is here and uh, Lexi and Diane are going to do comparison. Hello everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Hi. We're going to do the summer collection of uh, uh, comparison. So uh, Leslie was up here and she wanted to just go over a few of her little thoughts about it before we get started. Well, I'm just so. excited. You guys are in good hands here with Lexi and Diane doing the comparisons. Comparisons are so important. It's probably one of the number one questions we get. You guys love the colors, but you're like, is that close to this? Is this, is, you know, what's the difference here? Or so, is it something I already have? Yeah. Yes. So this no, way. No, it's not to answer your question. No, it's not. <laughs> but, but you know, you might get, oh, I have a client that just needs that tone. You know, I mean, you know what you're clients want to wear don't you yeah and just getting these out to swap to compare it blows my mind because i say oh that's so close to x y and z and then i get them out and look at them and it's like no yeah. there's definitely a niche for each and every one of these and you're gonna tell them that today. yes i am anyway you guys i hope you've ordered this collection it is Viva La Fiesta. no one's even said the name yes. oh, oh, oh it's terrible let's say you say it so well Viva La Fiesta. Viva La Fiesta. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, very nice. <laughs> uh, fun, bright, uh, summer, bold, also some softs. I really, really, really am liking the glitters in this collection because mm. they're fun to summer colors, but I love it because they're a little bit soft, so you can just kind of wear them by themselves. You oh don't my have goodness, to have a color yes. under them. Yes, um, already Save Water Drink Tequila has been a really popular color mm. with my clients. They've been wearing, of course, I have access to it a little earlier than the rest of you guys, sorry. Uh -huh. How did that, you get access oh, to it? I know a Who few people. Who gave it to you? She knows a few people. <laughs> I know a few people. Anyway, this one seems to be the most popular over, you know, pink, ideal pink fillers mm. and stuff like that. So, uh, fillers, I always call my, 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 Filter your product. pink Lexi lines my pink Lexi line fillers what filler do you want today um save what that's I'm wearing that next I'm obsessed with that uh, you really? just like the name Lexi no I love yes, that it's icy. all about the name well I did name it so I'm a little biased <laughs> anyway so I'm gonna let these um, I'm gonna get out of here I got a lot of stuff going on downstairs but I always love dropping in and saying hi to everybody and um, you guys have a good time here and they're gonna lead you down this road of what you absolutely have to have and show you that things are not too close, right? To no, no, no. Well, We're... thank you, Liz, for your intro. Oh, you're fine. And now, and you let's again, go. Call me back in. <laughs> All right. Bye. All right. Do we want to swing that light over and get we can get business. down to business? Okay, guys. So we're gonna start off with our-, our oh, Should we show them first? Right? Yes, look, ooh, so pretty. These are our glitters, but we're gonna start off with our colors first today. I love the way they just swatch right out. Aren't they pretty? So pretty. Pretty, pretty like a birdie. Right. Okay, so we're gonna start off with Hot as a Jalapeno. This color you is- You wanna move it in this camera a little bit further. Okay. Right about, yeah, right. Right about here? Okay. Yep, perfect. So this is- Holland as a jalapeno. Oops. Can you go the other way? So your hand, yeah. there you go. Yeah. This is a really nice coral. It's got wow. a little bit of a shimmer to it. Oh my goodness, our P Plus covers in one coat. I just love P Let's Plus. See bottle. If that's not hot for summer, then I don't I, know what it exactly. is. This is going to be great on toes. Yes. This is going to be a wonderful one on toes. So Hi, these Bedar. He's on his way from Iceland. So, See you tomorrow, my friend. So these is our hot as a jalapeno. You can move him if you want to kind of come. Yeah. So here is our hot as a jalapeno. And here we go. So these are the few colors that I picked. So go do the Van Gogh go. But it has a darker. yeah, it's definitely darker. It's a, a lot pinker to me too. Then we have Sunrise Roundup. But this has a shimmer in it. Mm -hmm. Pretty darn close. Yeah, but it's really frosty. So, for, so for, for those of you who don't like the frosty look and you just like that base color, yeah. then Hot as a Jalapeno is perfect. Then we have one of Angela's favorites, Short Skirt Flirt Flirt. This is definitely, this is definitely a, I want to call this a cotton candy pink compared to Hot as a Jalapeno. Oh, it's way, it's, it's a lot brighter. Yes. Yes, this is almost a neon kind of color yep. versus. And more pink. Yes. And then we have Let's Get Together. Pretty close. 
less orange. Less orange. Trying to get a good angle. Yeah. You want it to, yeah, there you go. So you can see that it's a little bit more pink and less shimmer. For sure. Then counting coral sheep. This oh, is orange. again, this is more in the orange shade, mm -hmm. whereas um, counting uh, coral sheep is definitely more pink. Yep. So I wouldn't even say those are comparable. Yeah, no. And you think in your mind, what you, okay, this is what I have in my drawer. This is going to look so much like what I have. But then when you do them side by side, they no. are definitely. Well, and it's clearly orange and pink. Yes. Then let's go here. I melt for you. I melt for you. So which is darker. very, I would call these almost sistery kind of colors. Yeah. Um, this one is the older sister. She's a little darker. She's a little so, darker. Yeah, so that's I melt for you. A little less bright. Yes. You want, you want something that pops a little bit more hot as a jalapeno. And then we have Sassy Lassie. Sassy Lassie, again, is, I thought it was going to be dead on, and it wasn't. It no. is definitely, this is more, I'm more into the red shade to me yeah, compared to. Yeah, and a lot darker than what yes, I thought. Yes, uh, exactly. This is what these comparisons are so great about. Wow, so hot as a jalapeno definitely has a spot. Yes, it does. Um, if, very beautiful. Yeah. Been for sure. So, okay. So then let's move on to our next one. If you guys have any questions along the way, let us know. Diane, what are you wearing? People are asking already. Want to oh. show, show a little hand? We, I have on Seriously Succulent. Oh, God, I am a so purple bad. girl, as you can tell by and my so hair. I. <laughs> I know, I forgot that's what you were wearing. And, and I went ahead and I thought, oh, I never wear purple on my nails ever. So I, I thought this was the one today. So, okay, let's... Next color we're going to do is... Um, Nina Bonita. You are so bonita. Nina Bonita. Let's slide this in. Okay. And again, this is our P Plus. Uh, look, look at, at that this. coverage on that. This is going to be a really good summer neutral color. This is going to be a good bright color. Oh, yeah. This Brides one, will love it. Yeah. I love this pink. It's a little bit different because it has a little bit of a peachy undertone. So it's on the warmer side versus the cooler side. And I think that's what makes this light pink unique. Yeah. Let's slide this out of the way. So here is our Nina Bonita. And I got prickly pink. Oh, can you? Last time the hottest oh, jalapeno okay. is on that. Oh, it's going to okay. make my brain hurt. If, okay. Oh, look, you can tell how peachy yeah. that is. Yes, exactly. I, again, I thought it was going to be more in the pink shades, but it, it's not. So, so that's prickly pink. Then we're going to have heirlooms. Heirloom is definitely... Um, I want to call this a plummy shade in the heirlooms, yeah, but much, I much browner. It's it, for sure. Um, I thought it was more of a neutrally color. It it is, but they're definitely off yeah, way out. Much the different. Much different. Power nap. Power nap. Power nap is a popular one. Okay, a lot muddier. Yeah, for sure. Muddier, a little bit more of a brown undertone. And I believe, looking at the Nina Bonita, correct me, Lexi, it does have a little bit of a shimmer to it. It does. There is a, a, a very, very light shimmer. But you don't notice it unless the light catches yep. it just I think right. You can, I'm trying to focus. So, you can kind of see it a little bit if you move it, but so, it's pretty light. Okay, so then we're going to go over here into Naive. Again, it's more oh, yeah. on the plum side versus Nina Bonita. Yeah, a little bit more rosy. For sure. And then searching for she shells. This is pretty close. There's definitely sisters, but you can see Nina Bonita is a lot peachier. Picture. So searching for seashells is more pink. Oh, that's a good angle. You can really tell a difference there. Okay, so then we're gonna move into pink pumps. Pink pumps. And I thought again this was gonna be another one that was gonna be dead on in my mind, but it, it's not because this has a this would be a cute set because they kind of offset each, each other. Each other. This has a whole lot more white undertone yep. to it. Nina Bonita has more color. Yes. Perfect. So then let's move into our So these are the cooler tones here. These are butter this is butterflies. This is Leslie's go-to. Yep, this is Leslie's go-to. And again, so it's warm, definitely warm tone, cool tone, can completely see the difference. And then we have the cat's meow. The cat's meow. So we have the cat's meow again, Much which different. is, yeah. A lot so more white, more pink. When you put the cat's meow up against this, this has a topier color to me. Yeah. So again, depending on the color clothing you're wearing with it, it it's gonna. This is gonna be a little bit of a chameleon yeah, no, kind of no, change. No, no, just, she's a fun one, and she definitely has a different take on a light pink. For sure. So okay. Perfect. So then let's move into. 
Maraca. Maraca Mama. Mama. Ooh, this is one of my favorites. Um, I love just the uniqueness of this one. Okay, so, see so this is good. I like that this one has a little bit of a shimmer in it too. And it's like an it's like an irid it's like a pearl iridescent shimmer. I know. It's see, it's very it rich. It has a it's definitely in the it's purple, but it has that slight blue gray yes. undertone. It's like a muddled lavender with with pearl. It's a rich lavender is what yeah. I would call this. Yes. So, okay. Very nice. Yeah, I'm interested to see what we have that's Okay. Similar here. Alrighty. So, soft serve. Soft serve. Wow. A lot lighter. It, yes. <laughs> wow, it, these would make a make, great set. Th th this would make an, a great ombre. Yeah. Oh, it would. This would be a great ombre, these two together. So, and then we have Butter Me Up. Again, another, another great, great ombre. Set. Wow, Marco Mama's a lot darker than some of these. Yes. And it doesn't look like it in the bottle or in the pot. You're right, it is rich. So, Under the Moonlight. Oh yeah, much uh, uh, I always thought that Under the Moonlight was definitely purpley purpley, but it has a it has blue a, gray yeah, undertone. Gray undertone. Which this has the same, but this um, Maraca Mama is definitely purple compared yes. to it. Love it. And then we have Knockin' Boots. Knockin' Boots, wow, that's a really gray undertone. Yes. Very complimentary, these two these together. These are, those are beautiful. This gives you guys some good set ideas. So, Love it. And then we have Lazy Day Lavender. Wow, and now we go the other direction. A little bit more, what do you call that? Blue? Uh, yes. This is definitely, this has more of a- pink. Uh, Yes, rosy undertone to me. So Lazy Day Lavender has a rosier undertone where um, Maraca Mama definitely has that blue gray undertone. Yeah. Those would make a good set too. Yes, all of these make I a know. really good set with it. And then we have Thank You Note. Okay, much rosier, a little on the browner side. For sure. More neutral. Correct, yeah. But wow. again, all of our old colors plays with Maraca Mama. Wow, it really does. Okay. So then our next one is gonna be a guave. Let's slide this little guy back agave. in here. Agave, I love agave because it goes into tequila. <laughs> this oh. is a really good neutral. This is a darker neutral. I like it. I call it a neutral with a lot of color. It's just, it's got. It's a rich neutral. It's just got a lot of vibrancy to it. It's a summer neutral because it does pop some color. Yes, it does. So if you don't want to wear something bright and neon, it's perfect. Okay. Oh, well, let me switch these around so I don't get on her. Okay, here we go. There you go. This is I'm Cured. Okay, much oranger. And darker. This is definitely a more fall kind of color to me. Mm -hmm. So we have that. Then she, she's a knockout. More warm, a little yes. bit more yellow. Okay, those are actually pretty good. Yeah, they don't. They, they are. Oh, this is going to be another good ombre. And then a mother's memories. Okay, more yellow. Yes, and whereas this is definitely a peachier undertone. Yep. Camel one hump or oh, wow. two. Wow, way different. But and again, in my mind, they were closer. Close, they were way closer than this. Yeah, much more orange. I'll pose for Leo. Okay, a little bit closer. These ones I would call sister, and then this one would be um, the big sister to this one. Yeah, this but, I'll pose for Leo is lighter, a little bit more white in it, a little rosier. And then we have what's in your basket, which is definitely a lot peachier. Yep. Wow, way different. Meet me at the market. Wow, way different. I thought these. Were I would thought closer. they were going to be right on top of each other, color-wise. The wise. market almost looks more like orange compared to agave. And, and through the oh yeah, oh sorry, it's lighter on. Through the phone, it looks a little bit darker. Yeah. Okay, and then the last one in this one, prim and proper, which is definitely pink. Definitely pink, but it's good to show all areas. 
So. That agave, I think, I think that's going to be just, it's a good year round staple in your collection. Um, this is going to, this, this goes right along with what's neutral right now. Everything is soft, very ladylike. This is on the darker side of that ladylike, but this is a good one for that, that what's going in the trends right now. I love it. Perfect. Okay. Does anyone have any questions so far? Cynthia's excited that there's a purple in the collection. Yes. That Baraka Mama is awesome. Okay, so then our next one is going to be... how pretty they are together so far. Holy guacamole. This is my favorite. I, I wore this one for about three weeks. I just took it off yesterday, and everywhere I went, people were like, I want that color. It's the perfect... What would you call it? Like a more of a teal? It for, yeah, teal it is. Blue meets green. Really fun. Let me see it in the bottle. Wow, so pretty. I just love Gorgeous. this one. Gorgeous. This is so fun. They all look so good together. Too. Okay, so holy, gua holy, gua holy guacamole. Thank you. Lisa. Say that 10 times fast. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, we didn't have as many as we had with the others. So here we go with holy, gu holy guacamole. Holly. <laughs> out of frame, sorry. And then Mr. Peabody. Oh, yes. Ooh, those look sexy together. Mm-hmm. But yeah, much darker, much more black in it. Very different. And then we're going to move into Central Park Stroll. Okay. Almost looks more green. Yes, it does. And um, Central Park's uh, Stroll is a muddier looking teal kind of color, mm -hmm. but it brings the blue out in ho holy, guac ho holy guacamole. Why yeah. do I want to say holly? Well, we have a holly that works here. So That's, it and is she, she makes, and she's the, she's our color maker. She's our glitter maker. Yeah, she's, yeah. And then we have Cleopatra. Ooh, my favorite. And I thought these were going to be twinsies. I thought that this was going to be the winter and. Actually, you have like a green version of teal, teal and, and blue, blue version. version. I thought they were going to be almost identical and they definitely are not. Wow, no. So, get the wrong way. Let's. Night Terror Teal. Okay, much Which greener, is definitely greener. Lighter. And, yeah, th these would make a really good ombre, yeah, too. Yeah, they would. They're really pretty. And then, of course, Lucky Horseshoe. Lucky Horseshoe. Much lighter. Ooh, these would be pretty, too. Uh-huh. So, I love that. So any of you guys who are into the teal or the turquoise, this would make an awesome turquoise stone. It would. On a nail art ring. Or like Western turquoise. Any of that. So this is a, if you're into that Western or, or Southwestern look, this is going to be your go-to for the summer. Wow, so, perfect. Holly, holy guacamole. Holy, ho holy guacamole. <laughs> All see. right, I think we have one more color left. Can you guys guess what it is? Okay. And this is the color for 2023, I believe them, and considered in the magenta shade, and I would definitely consider this. And so here we go. This one is seriously succulent. And is she succulent? And wow. there she is. It's like the perfect fuchsia. It, Pink it, meets purple. So let me see it. Ooh, ooh she's wow. just like ooh. ooh. She's pretty. I love the way she just drops like that. Yep. Such a awesome. pretty color. Look at those together. And I again, there so wasn't much. that many in our collection that I felt was, you know, like in the same category without having shimmer in them. Oh, so yeah. Two, we of have them, a... two of them have shimmer. So Predator in Pink, wow. one of our recent collections, which is a deeper fuchsia purpley kind of color with mm -hmm. this shimmer. So a lot of shimmer too. That one's definitely frosted. Mm-hmm. So much different. And then we have Your sticks, right? Yeah. Okay, then fuchsia fantasy. Oof. So, so this these two are pretty much right on. This one has shimmer in it. Yeah, fuchsia fantasy succulent is cooler. Yeah, it's got more blue to it, and you can see it a lot. And you think it has more pink in it until see how it looks like it has a whole lot more pink in it. Then you put something pink in there, and it changes it, looks it completely. More purple. So. Wow, yeah, those are pretty together. And then we're gonna have fashion. More purple, a little more black in there. And then we're gonna have true love, which again 
is more pink. Wow, yeah. More pink. Those are pretty though. It makes Seriously Succulent look purple almost. Mm-hmm. And then we have Dream On. Dream On! Which is definitely pink again. Mm -hmm. So all of the shades that I had access to for swatching, because a lot of our colors were discontinued, um, I thought were definitely in that purple shade, mm -hmm. definitely look pink compared to Seriously Succulent. Yes, so. very nice. Okay. Those are beautiful. So here are Shimmer and Nina Bonita there and the Pearl in Morocco Mama. So there are two shimmers, four creams. Wait, Holy Jalapeno actually has a little bit of a shimmer, but just okay. a little bit. So now we're gonna go on to our glitters <laughs> and here we go with extra spicy. Wow. Oh, you can just tell how opaque that is too. I wore this when I first saw it you guys were doing a shoot for it a while back and I came in and saw Ashley working with it and I had to have it on my nails. So I had um, uh, oh, right out my head it went the color. Extra spicy. Extra spicy. Okay, so. Now we can move him and get out the sticks. Okay, there wasn't that many in the yeah, I glitters not. that we I found that we had. So, okay, so sea jelly, but sea jelly has bigger pieces in and it's it, pinker, and definitely pinker. Yep. Then my masterpiece again, which had it's in the pink shade with bigger pieces. Mm -hmm. It does flash some orange though, so I could see how you would want to compare them a little bit. Then we have Tangerine Dream. Wow, much different. More yellow. It has, you know, these would be a good glitter yeah, ombre. Pretty. It's really pretty. And again, oh, it's fighting me. Nice melons. Thank you. <laughs> That's much more yellow. And then we have Tipsy Two-Step. Tipsy Two-Step, that's what I do on a Friday night all the Which time. again, I would say that these could be, you know, big sister, little sister type. But and two again, different, completely complete. different tones. We don't have another orange. Wow. Not, it's a lot of them were discontinued. So for those of you who have been with us for a while, Whimsical Way was another one that was excellent. Uh, Whimsical Hope, Way. Hope had it in her comparison. A little bit pinker? Yes, a little yes, bit pinker, a little, a little pinker. bit purple. So. Okay. Any comparisons, you guys? We're not getting any, we're not getting any requests yet. So we'll just keep going. Okay, then we're going to go with oh, this one Fiesta so Time. Fun. This one is very unique. What do you guys think about this one so far? Is this something that you like? Kind of has a peachy base with those those hot fuchsia and purple glitter pieces. It actually even looks like it has a little bit of a blue yeah, in it to me. It's the blue and purple, it's really pretty. So. I love it. Actually, this over agave is a really nice color. color. Yes, and that's been popular again already for us who have oh, access. Oh, fire to breather. Fire yes, breather, yes. That's a good one. That's a great one. Okay. Fire breather. I'll have to pull that one out or, or figure out what the difference. I think fire breather might be darker. Uh, yeah, I couldn't find it. So that's the reason why you guys didn't get to. Okay, so then we have beachy, which is more in your yellow and mm -hmm. green tones. It doesn't have the purple and pink. No, it has the fine uh, glitter, but definitely not the same. Then we have orange crush and we know whose favorite that is oh I love, I'm, it's on my toes right now <laughs> it makes me so happy mm -hmm. no, nothing not similar at all so yeah but it does have that little bit of yellow in there and then we have be in your bonnet which to me was kind of the closest be in your bonnet has a lot more silver undertone to it mm -hmm. goldy silvery undertone yeah and then we have Sandy Bottoms. This was a little bit closer to me, but it has the bigger pieces of glitter in it. And it's- um, Much darker. Yeah. 
texture. It has a, a lot more of a brown to it. What about here. smoothie? I'm gonna throw one out. Smoothie. Keeping you on your toes, Diane. Oh yeah, we're gonna have to look at this. We might have to look at it. Yeah. That's okay. I just figured if we had it, I know smoothie's kind of more of a neutral one as well. Takes off. Yeah. Help me look for it, guys. <laughs> um, smoothie's okay. been discontinued. Oh, okay. That's the reason being. All it's right. been discontinued. It's not up here. <laughs> and I don't believe it had that purple and blue uh, flash. So then on the, the next one is going to be on the rocks. Beautiful. I love this crystallina. Crystallina with a flash. This is going to be another one that's going to be good for wedding nails this season wow. because it has the white wow. pieces in there. Beautiful. Just makes me want to jump into the vat. Oh, I know. It's so pretty. Okay. So here's on the rocks and strands of pearls. Okay. Do we need something of color behind it? Does it, um, can I mean, you see? see it pretty good. Okay. So there Definitely we Definitely see this one's much finer. It's almost like a it's, shimmer. It's a more silver too. Mm -hmm. So there's that one. It's missing the white. Yes. And then Salty Sweet, which has the white in it, but it doesn't have iridescent. Ooh, those would look pretty together. Yes, they would. Again, another really good color for wedding nails. Perfect. Yeah, sometimes it's not just, this isn't just for comparing. It's also seen what goes together. Yes. Then we have Tiny Diamond. And of course, Tiny Diamond goes with everything. Yeah. But it has a gentler mm -hmm. uh, iridescent versus um, On the Rocks. Oh, on the Rocks is a little chunkier. Yes. Really pretty. Sequin of events. Sequin this is an oldie events. but goodie. So there's not any white in the background of this one and it's chunkier, but it, it, they go really good together too. It was a close one for me. And sorry guys, this one's on a white swatch. Ice cream, you scream. Mm, more pink. Yes, purple. purple it has a purple pink. in it and with the bigger chunks yeah. in it. But I thought it was definitely gonna be head on, but it, it has that purpley blue undertone. Yeah much different. They do look pretty together. So, okay. I love it. All right, on the last one, we do have Fuchsia Fantasy, Positively Charged, and Language of Love for the Seriously Succulent. So maybe we'll pull those at the end. Yeah. We'll just continue on. Language of Love has been discontinued, so. Okay, next one is gonna be our pink. Ooh, salud. Salud. I like the way Lexi says the name. She says I'm so better. <laughs> I just got back from Mexico too, so I'm feeling I'm feeling like my uh, accents on point right now. <laughs> so there. Wow, that's Salud. beautiful. We needed a really good pink glitter gel. Yeah, we um, a lot of our pinks have been discontinued, so we have a wide niche here, and as you can see. I had to dive into the archives for to get you these. You dive, girl. You dive into those archives. Okay. So, okay. my masterpiece. It's wow, chunky. Much chunkier. And more in the purple shade versus mm -hmm. Salute is pink. Yes. Want a watercolor? Not right now, but maybe later. <laughs> I'm right. sorry, I gotta, I gotta crack some bad jokes. <laughs> a little dingier, Dear, yes. Darker. Um, the pieces of glitter in Salute is are bigger. Mm -hmm. Salute this is, is much airier and lighter. Yes, I was gonna just say, uh, one of watercolor is muddy. Yeah. So if, if a glitter can be muddy, that one is. So then we have sweet tea, which is more in your corally peachy shade. Mm -hmm. Yep. More of a yellow flash too. Yeah. And then last, losing my impatience. Mm. Oh, those are pretty together. These ones again could be sisters. So less pink, mm -hmm. more fine. Losing my impatience again seems to be more on the muddier side to mm -hmm. me for a glitter. 
and it doesn't have that iridescent flash as well. Yeah. So really pretty though. I like those. Okay. Any comparisons for these ones? Nope. Okay. Next one. Oh, are we saving the best for? Oh, we have two more. I we have two the more best was for last. No, no, no. We're saving that one for last. Next is Cactus Makes Perfect. Oh my gosh, I love those so much. It's so pretty. Ah. If you like blue, if you like green, if you like aqua, this is it. Great coverage, very opaque. Beautiful. Okay, so that cactus makes perfect. Oh, bubblegum baby on that last one. Yes. And take a note of that after. Okay. Thank you, Jessica. We will do that when we are done with these last two glitters. Okay. Fumble fingers. <laughs> Okay, so here is our Cactus Make Perfect and Meet Me at the Blueberries. Ooh, a lot lighter. Yes. They, they complement each other yes, very they do. nicely. They have the same um, crystal-y looking iridescent -y under, this has more white in it. Yeah, a lot lighter. Very pretty. Then another one of Lexi's favorites, Snow oh Cone. Oh my God. So we have wow. Snow Cone. This is gonna make a good ombre, these so, two. Cactus Mix Perfect is darker, a little bit more depth. But once again, these would be pretty together. Very pretty. Love it. Once Upon a Tide. It has bigger, chunkier, iridescent mm -hmm. pieces in it, but the basic undertones are similar. Um, Cactus Mix Perfect is richer looking. Mm -hmm. That's a lot finer. Then we have just a few more sleeps, which is more on the green side. Wow, it does look green compared. And I didn't think really it was green, in though. my mind until I got the swatch out. I was like, Ooh, yeah, okay, but we're gonna put it in. It there. almost has more of like a metallic look to it. It's got that silvery kind of shine. And then we have Deja Blue. Wow. Which, which also looks more green. green. It looks teal almost. That is so weird. It's, it's, it looks teal green compared to the blue. Wow. Because if you just asked me what color Deja Blue was, I I'd would say, say blue. blue. <laughs> Definitely. Hence the name. Yeah, but you in your mind's eye, when you take it away, you think yeah. blue, and then you bring back here, and it goes into the green shades. Yep. And then there's Peacock. Peacock, one of my favorites. Which, wow, is darker than Cactus Makes Perfect. When I opened the container first time when I saw Cactus Makes Perfect, that's what I, my first thought was, this is Peacock. Much different. But it, definitely, so. This is a, oh, Peacock used to be my favorite. It was my ultimate. So. I haven't worn it in years. Okay. Wow, okay. Oh, blast but not please. So the last is going to be Lexi's. Oh my gosh. This is my favorite. I think this is the most unique uh, glitter in the collection. This one is going to be so wonderful over just any color. You can go with a nude nail. You just put your um, Lexi Line Fill product on, extremes, your one step in the, whatever color you want to use. Put a coat of this over the top and you're going to be mm -hmm. out the door. I love the icy look. A little bit Ideal of a pink, in baby there. pink. It's oh. like the perfect, just like clean summer. This looks really great over the cashmere. Oh, I bet. One coat of this over cashmere was, whoa. Or this, I saw someone do a YouTube video and they put this over Morocco Mama, which gave that purple, it enhanced the purple in it. Vani, our front desk really gal's wearing that right now. So it's pretty. so pretty. Okay. All righty, let's see what we have here. We didn't have too many left. I was gonna say, we probably don't have too many. Say hello. Hello. There he goes. Viva la fiesta. So here's our safe water drink tequila with Breathless. Yeah, just a little bit. There you go. Perfect. Wow, much different. Mm-hmm. You can see how just clear and white that is. When you can really see the blue in that one. The, the glitter is definitely chunkier in um, drink water, safe water drink tequila. Love it. 
My brain is working on way much too co coffee today. Yeah, you, your words are from like... I I had... I'm just going to start calling it Holly Guacamole now. <laughs> <laughs> I drank way too much coffee already. Ooh, yeah. Okay, so here we go. This Pears and pastries. Okay. Which is very similar to me, but this has a um, metal, gunmetal y undertone to yep. it. And it's a little, it's finer. So. You can see the chunks in, say, water drink tequila. Then we have crystal, good old crystal. Classic. And this shows you how much color is in is safe, safe water, water drink, drink tequila. tequila. That is a long name. It is. Holy mackerel. Or holy guacamole. Holy, <laughs> holly guacamole. Holly guacamole. <laughs> We're all, everybody's going to be calling it that now. Ice cream, you scream. These two complement each other. Very pretty. Really nice. Yeah, but very different. Yes. The, uh, ice cream, uh, ice cream, you scream has bigger chunks. Mm hmm So, and not everybody's into a chunky glitter. Some people want the fine glitter. Yes. Yes. I'm, with, I'm a fine glitter gal. Yeah, I have clients that just won't do the, the chunky glitters. A spot by the stream. Again, another wow. chunky Much one. Much more silver. And I thought it had as, men, as much iridescent, but Save Water Drink Tequila definitely has more iridescent mm -hmm. to it. Oh, it's just perfect. Just like tequila. Okay, so. Beautiful. Wow, love it. So these guys are Should we your... see them all together? Yeah. Oh. You guys, look how pretty it is. It's just gorgeous. So while we look at these, do you want to grab Bubblegum Baby, Fuchsia Fantasy, and Positively Charged? Okay, so tell Bubble me which one's baby. your favorite, you guys. Here we go. Here's Bubblegum Baby. So Bubblegum Baby, I feel like it's a little pinker. It's a little brighter. Um, what was the other two? Uh, uh, positively Charged and Fuchsia Fantasy. Positively Charged and Buttercream. Yeah. We'll have Diane um, swatch that, but I think it is. I okay, think it's fairly so different. Positively charged has been discontinued, so I don't have it. You do? I see it. Where? Oh, that's chemical imbalance. No, nope. right, the right of the box, right there, right, right up one. Yep. Oh. So here we go. Positively charged. You want to switch, and then I'll just hold this up with it. This is much different. Yeah. A positive charge is a lot darker, but it's good to see. Should we bring it down into? Oh yeah, much more berry. For sure. Very, very cool toned. A lot darker. Ooh, these would be pretty together. I'm digging it. Look at our buttercreams, how nice that's covering. Oh, we should just do like a swatch party. Look at that. Yeah, much different, a lot darker, but they would look pretty together. They would. And do you want to swatch this, uh, what was this called? Bubblegum Baby real Bubble quick. Gum, bubble gum Baby. Bubble Gum Baby. Okay, Bubble Gum Baby. It's definitely pinker. Wow, it is pinker. Interesting, yeah, a lot different. Two completely different tones. But they have some similarities. Yeah, um, uh, Salud has a, a, a more concentrated of the crystal kind of glitters, mm -hmm. whereas Bubblegum Baby has a finer dust. Yes, in. and it's just it's more pink. pink. Perfect, okay. Uh, yummy Gummy is a blue. Oh, you want Yummy Gummy to what? Save water, drink tequila? I would assume that's what right, they're talking about, right? Yeah. Because we, I guess we could do it with both, but Yummy Gummy is pretty, pretty um, soft and um, translucent. Actually, those would look really pretty together. <laughs> is our Yummy Gummy still up here? I don't know. Sorry guys, we gotta find stuff. Yeah. Yummy gummy. Let's see if we can see it again. No? It's gotta be somewhere. There it is. Oh, found it. Woo! Sometimes the lighting in here with the way the tops are, it's hard to see. So here's our yummy gummy. Oh yeah. 
much different, but ooh, those look pretty. So let me pull, say, water drink tequila first. So Yummy Gummy is going to be much bluer. Where, say, water drink tequila is a little bit more icy. It's got a little bit more silver. Yeah. And I don't have any, it's not on a clear swatch. So, so it's no, you like, can see the difference. Yeah. Much different. And so then let me done. just grab this one just in case. So yeah, much, Maybe, much much more condensed, bluer. Wow, those are pretty together. They are. All right, I think we got it. Is that it? We did all the comparisons. Here's the beautiful, beautiful. six colors. They look so great together, you guys. I hope you love them. This was truly such a fun collection to do, such a labor of love from everybody here at HQ. Um, we had a lot of fun with this one. So let us know in the comments what your favorite is, what you're going to be using, what your clients will love. And we will see you in the next comparison video, which will be fall. Yeah. Oh, gosh, that's one more, one more time. Yeah, one more time, guys. There All right. Go. Say bye, Diane. Bye. Bye, guys. Thank you for watching.